Delta Airlines is gearing up for a sizable order for the Boeing 737 MAX. The operator is in discussions for up to 100 units of the MAX 10, a model that is currently going through certification. Let's take a look at what this means for both Boeing and the US airline. Modern discussions between Delta and Boeing about the 737 MAX date back to November 2020, when Delta CEO Ed Bastian made comments about the aircraft. Bastian said if there was an opportunity where his airline would feel comfortable taking on the type, there wouldn't be hesitation. Additionally, there was revived speculation last September when Bastian told pilots there was a place for the MAX if the company could figure out how to bring them in. Now the prospects have increased once again, with Reuters reporting that Boeing is in talks with the Atlanta-based carrier for an order of up to 100 MAX 10s. The formal announcement could be made as soon as April, according to sources of the publication. Following the report by Reuters, John Ostrower of The Air Current tweeted that he was able to independently confirm that advanced talks were indeed taking place between Boeing and Delta. However, there are still some big question marks with the MAX 10, namely its certification. As we noted in a previous Simple Flying video, certification of the type could drag into next year. This would force Boeing to update the aircraft's cockpit systems. Boeing has stated that it is currently working with the FAA to provide relevant information and is committed to meeting expectations to achieve the model's certification. At the same time, the playmaker is reportedly looking for an exemption to the required update should it miss its December 2022 deadline. In service, the 737 MAX 10 would be able to carry up to 230 passengers. The jet has a range of 3,300 nautical miles or 6,110 kilometers, made possible with the addition of an auxiliary fuel tank. Even though Delta hasn't placed any 737 MAX orders thus far, it does operate 737s from the Next Generation series. Delta is also a fan of the Airbus A320 family, holding the A319, A320 and A321. Moreover, it flies the A220, which is also becoming increasingly popular across the industry. The carrier's first A321neo rolled out of the paint shop earlier this year, with the firm expecting a total of 155 units of the type. Finally, with over 120 757s still in Delta's fleet, the modern narrow-body solutions for both Boeing and Airbus will undoubtedly work well to replace the aging units to some extent. While Delta has been more Team Airbus than its fellow US legacy carriers, the MAX 10 should fit quite well into the airline's already diverse fleet of narrow bodies. What are your thoughts on Delta's possible order? Let us know what you think in the comments section. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.